So basically we have a responsibility to our local government, local law enforcement response. We have, could be county, state, um, if you had a state police agency that requests us. You also have to deal with the federal government, uh, whether it be the FBI, um, ATF. We also work with the Secret Service and the State Department on protection details. Um, and we'll help them when needed. If there's military calls for, uh, you know, military ordinance calls for us off base, we'll handle that, we'll assist them. If they need help doing disposal operations or basically more hands, if they're looking for, for bodies to help them do things, we can do that also. There are different rules, so to speak, how we have to operate on our own soil. Um, certain procedures differ. So getting the guys back into that mentality where they, they have to operate with a stateside mentality and basically work with other team members. That's another thing too. Um, always working with the same people, you can get kind of stagnant. So running scenarios, if some of the teams are mixed up, um, you know, one person's from one unit, one person's from another unit, you get to see different techniques. Um, you get to have instructors here that have done different things. So it gives them the ability, basically allows them to put more tools in their toolbox. So it's kind of nice to pull different units together. You get a lot of different experiences, different ranks were here. So it's not like um, you just have a bunch of E6s, you know, discussing problems. You have, you know, from a, a young airman all the way up to obviously a chief. Um, and, and with that comes a lot of experience, a lot of knowledge. And it's, it's good to get together and, and basically work out and share that knowledge. And this is a very beneficial place to do that.